For today's video, I'm going to be showing three different pairs of sweatpants that I own and how I'm going to be styling them. The first pair that I'm going to style is my classic gray sweatpants. These are from Forever 21. They're from the men's section. Unfortunately, all the Forever 21s have closed down in my city. Since they are from the men's section, they are a bit baggier. They're also a bit thicker, which is nicer for winter time. The second pair of sweatpants that I'm going to be styling are these adidas sweatpants so i actually got these adidas sweatpants from winners and i was looking through the little boys section and i ended up finding these i think they were like a size large in the little boys section and that turned out to fit me so yeah so two out of the three sweatpants that i'm styling are from the boy section. I don't know, they just like are more comfortable sometimes and I just like the styles a little bit better. But surprisingly, these were only $30. Definitely recommend if you're looking for sweatpants to go to winners and look around. And lastly, I'm going to be styling these green sweatpants and they have a stripe down the side of the leg. They are thinner than the other two sweatpants and they don't cinch at the bottom of the pants leg. They're actually open a little bit and a little bit more flowy. These sit a bit tighter against my legs, but uh, yeah, there's just a different style. I also got these from Winners for $15 in the women's section and they are from Aerie. Okay, so now I'm going to style each pair of sweatpants. So I'm first going to put on this thrifted Fila top. It is a sports bra, but it's actually like a extra large so it kind of just fits me as a crop top so this is the fila top and i feel like just in general like any kind of crop top looks good with sweatpants especially gray sweatpants they just literally go with anything but i'm gonna add a jacket on top and some earrings so i'm gonna add in this windbreaker it is a thrifted reebok windbreaker and actually my friend thrifted it and then gave it to me so it's like double thrifted or <laughs> double second hand and then I'm just gonna throw on some hoops it's kind of more athletic sporty but still laid back I just put on my Nikes which I'm probably gonna wear for most of this video because this is a sweatpants styling video not a shoe video but anyways yeah and obviously it's not very warm but we're going to bump it up and make it warmer so don't worry <laughs> you can also just zip up the windbreaker halfway and put it off the shoulder and again it looks just super chill and cute so to make this outfit a little bit warmer i'm going to be adding this white turtleneck with the turtleneck and the windbreaker it gives off a very vintage vibe kind of like a ski vibe i don't know i think it's like really cute though so you can do that or if you still want to add in the fila top let me show you how or like i don't know whatever kind of top that you might have that is similar okay so i really wish that this turtleneck was a cropped white turtleneck simply for this look because i just put this over top of the turtleneck and then i fold it in like the bottom half of the turtleneck into the fila top but i just think it looks really really cute and i'm probably gonna go buy a cropped white turtleneck now <laughs> so i can do this look properly for some more warmth i'm gonna add in this super fluffy black reebok sweater I like just realized that my mirror is dusty, so I'm going to dust it off. This is with the fluffy Reebok sweater on. This outfit is super warm. I'm already like heating up, but I just let the Fila logo kind of just peek through a little bit. And yeah, I'm super warm. So I've now switched my pants to the Adidas pants and I'm still wearing the white turtleneck because I'm going to show you a quick outfit with this. I'm going to be putting on this coat that has these kind of like orange sleeves popping out and then I'm going to match it with this orange hat and that way you have kind of a somewhat put together outfit. This is the look with the Adidas sweatpants. So I feel like the turtleneck and the long coat is a classic look, but the sweatpants make the outfit a bit more comfortable. And then there's just a pop of color with the orange hat and the orange sleeves. So that's the first way that you can style your Adidas sweatpants. Next, I've thrown on a matching set. I got this top back in the summer, and then these obviously in the winter time, but this is not really like styling an outfit. This just is a set, so I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna make this outfit look different. So I'm gonna be adding some layers to this outfit. I'm first gonna be adding this cropped green cardigan, and then this white coat over top. 
Adding the green cardigan just kind of makes the outfit a little bit warmer. And I just really like how the Adidas symbol pops out from like the V neckline of the cardigan. I just think that's really cute. Besides the green cardigan, this outfit is very monochromatic as you can probably tell, but this jacket kind of just cinches in at the waist, which is nice. It's a little bit longer for winter and yeah. And then you got the stripes going down the leg. And if you want, you can add a cute little bag. If I can get it on. <laughs> and then I feel like that just makes the look a little bit more feminine. I don't know why, but I actually like really love how these green sweats have that little slit at the very bottom of the pant leg. But anyways, I am still wearing the Adidas top because I wanna show you one outfit with this and then we'll move on to another fit. So again, I'm gonna use a cardigan and this puffy jacket. This outfit's gonna be a little bit more colorful this time. So this is what the outfit looks like with just the cardigan over top. And it's given some like grandma vibes, but it's like comfortable grandma vibes. And again, the Adidas symbol peeking out, which I think is so cute. So I feel like this outfit comes together a lot better with this puffy jacket. It's just kind of like an orange bronze color and then the cardigan's a bit of like a yellow cream and then with the green, I just feel like the color scheme is, I don't know, different. I just feel like everyone always wears a lot of white and black so it's kind of nice to style some color. And if you want to tuck in your cardigan, you most definitely can because it'll elongate your legs a little bit more. So as you can see, it kind of made a pretty big difference when I tucked in the cardigan. It just really gave me the illusion of having longer legs, which is something that I do like. So if you want, you can even wear sweatpants with a bit of a nicer top. Like this is not super nice, but it has like a nice neckline cut and it's just very simple, but it does work. And I'm gonna add some accessories to make this outfit a little bit more interesting. I thought it would be fun to try on this plaid bucket hat and then this thrifted purse. Here it is. I'm actually in love with this look. I think it looks so good and it goes together really, really well. And like what I like about this outfit is that there's some really nice details like the plaid hat and then the stripe down the leg as well as the purse. However, this isn't the warmest outfit, so obviously you can just throw on a jacket, which I'm gonna do like right now. So just to be a little bit warmer, I added this black puffy jacket, and now you can wear this outfit in colder weather. <laughs> I think it's really, really cute. Okay, I think that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed the outfits that I styled. And if you have any other pieces of clothing that you'd like me to style, just comment down below. I can do that as well. But I just thought that it'd be fun to style sweatpants since it's cold now and sweatpants are like the only thing that I'm wearing. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And you can check out my Instagram at annie.underscore.grams. Yeah, that's my Instagram handle. I was like, wait, is there something else? <laughs> no, that's all. Anyways, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.